Hey, what's up, everybody? This is DJ Keo uh, coming to you with a new video. Um, just in the actually, I was gonna do it on uh, on uh, on camera, but I'm in the um, middle of packing up all my stuff for uh, interview, so that's gonna have to hold off for a bit. Anyways, I want to do a really quick, quick, quick video about the Phase uh, DJ system. <sighs> so. I don't know how to put this. I'm I'm concerned. Put it like this. I I was a big fan of the phase technology on on turntables because, you know, I, I said it I think three times already. Uh I, I like options. Options are good to me. So, you know, that, that whole concept uh was a little bit more interesting and a little bit more futuristic because it was using lasers and some other technologies to kind of align where where the vinyl is supposed to be instead of using a, a controlled vinyl or, you know, CDJ or whatever. So, like, the, the whole concept was interesting to me, and especially where uh, in the video I had, everyone's talking about needles, needles this, needles that, and then Sure cancels their needles. So, you know, like, this whole, the, the concept, it was interesting to me, to say the least. Uh, so... Fast forward to a little bit here. Uh, sure does a bunch of things, some tours across around the world. Actually, uh, I forgot some places they were doing it, but like they they were doing tours around the world. And <laughs> I was on Instagram not too long ago, and <laughs> it was just a bunch of angry people who who put orders in. And they were like, stop doing tours. You know, work on the project and release this thing. So <laughs> I thought that was crazy, man. It was, it was a lot of angry comments. If you still go there to the to Instagram, the the Phase DJ Instagram page, you're gonna see a lot of uh, angry comments from from people who place orders about it. And and to be fair, I, I understand where they're coming from with this. Like, you know, you you do an order and you. You want it to be come. You want it to come out on the release date you asked for, like flat out. Especially like if you you did some of the early orders before you know people really backed into the program. So you know I understand where they're coming from personally. Uh, in this instance, though, I I think from from Phase is uh, perspective, they have to get it right the first time. If they release this thing and it's buggy and it doesn't work right, phase is done. That technology's dead. The company's pretty much gonna fold. No one's gonna, you know, spend money to back this thing and just be like, well, we'll fix it in an update. Like this is not a video game. Like they're not gonna do that. The especially when Rain 12 has come out and Rain 12 works flawlessly. It does exactly what it said they was gonna do like it said it was going to do and everybody seems to be happy with it mixer and eh, they there's some issues and they, they've been doing some updates but as far as like the that that whole cdj type controller thing that works flawlessly so you know for the competition to come in here and have a thing that doesn't work they cannot afford that on any level so they have to get it right so I understand why they're they're pushing it back and and hopefully they they do get it back they get their act together at least. I'm I'm definitely rooting for them, <laughs> not because I back like I backed the wrong horse or anything like that, but like you know, it, um I like I like different technologies and and the, that seems futuristic to me, uh that type of technology the, the wireless thing and you know being able to place it on anything and make that go. Uh, that, you know, that's cool to me. Uh, motorized turntables. That's a thing. <laughs> it's been a thing for a while. It's <laughs> not as exciting. Uh, I, if it has screens on there, woo. All right. All right. It, for me to, if they made a version two, this is a, totally off topic here, but if they made a version two of the rain 12, and it had a USB port on it to plug in sounds and a screen. I'm there. 
because now I can use it. I don't, I don't have to use it with only Serato. I can, you know, I can use it with the tractor or your know, record box or like you know, virtual D's. Like, like now you have options. The the thing that they're selling right now, there's no options for me. And that's why I'm kind of like, eh. I, I understand there's a lot of people mad at me for that, but you know, I'm, I'm going to keep it 100 in the show. <laughs> Do people even say that anymore? Uh, that's the thing. Anyway. So, uh, you know, this is my thoughts on it. I, I hope they get their act together and they get this thing right. Uh, having delay is not good for the company. And this is not the first delay. I think this is the second or third delay. So, like, this is not good. Uh, but I'm rooting for them. I'm definitely rooting for them. And I want this thing to succeed. I want more technologies to succeed. i put it like that. I think a lot of people thought I was disparaging the Rain 12 and I'm not disparaging it. I just, it's not what I, what I would use personally. Um, but yeah, like uh, this whole thing, like I, I want technology to move forward and I'm definitely interested in how this thing works out. So, uh, hopefully rank get their act together. I mean, not rain, <laughs> sorry, face, hopefully face can get their act together. And uh, let's see what happens from this. Anyways, thank you for watching. This is a short video. Uh, I got <laughs> I got a busy couple of weeks coming up. Oh man. Uh, we'll see how it goes. First interview is on a uh, Saturday. It's a bit, it's gonna be a big deal. And the one after that is gonna be a big deal. And the one after that is gonna be very big deal. Uh, I'm not mentioning any names yet. Uh, <laughs> he's gonna have to wait and see. But anyways, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and uh, peace out. Man.